Hi guys, it's Pure Game and today we're back on GTA 5 British Police Mods and today we are the British Transport Police so we're going to do a firearms one because I think that would be more interesting. So today, to our disposal, we have a unmarked Mercedes Vito, we have a Mercedes Vito British Transport for London, then we have our next, I think it's the Ford Cougar, yes, the Ford Cougar British Transport vehicle and then we have our Volvo British Transport Police. I think I'm going to take the Volvo. I prefer it out of all of them. We'll take the Volvo and then we might do some stuff with the van as well. But we'll just see what happens. So we're going to be dealing with all British Transport Police type videos. So the airports, the trains, anything like that we'll be dealing with. So let's make ourselves available for call. Well, let's get out and call. Los Santos International. Um, we've just had a call come through of a man that is wanted. Units respond code two. A Hispanic man wearing a green hoodie. So we're gonna go down here. I believe he's in the airport. He could be in the train station bit or the actual terminal. I'm not too sure. I'm sure I'll have to find out. Look for a man wearing a green hoodie. Right, do we get out? Do we get the gun or do we just have our Glock? Go on, God. Gun, sh gun shots fired, shots fired, shots fired, shots fired. On police, on the floor. Put the weapon on the ground. That's it, nice and slowly. Go straight into it here with an immediate guy just pulling a gun out of British Transport Police. Now we're wearing the cap because when I googled it, they look to more wear caps than anything. And my partner's chasing someone else, so we'll just get some assistance for him. Right, okay, so I'm going to request a PNC check on a Sammy Croft, 26th, 7th, 1970. He's got an outstanding warrant. Okay, so what I'm going to do, sir, is I'm going to pat you down. If you've got anything on you, you can harm me or my partner, who seems to have run off anyway. Okay, he's got a bag of marijuana, so he's going to be further arrested for possession of drugs. Now, we're going to call a transport for him. I know we're around the corner, but we're transport police, but we need to deal with the situation. And our boot is mainly kept for firearm stuff anyway. Right, so that's the first suspect dealt with the day. We dealt with that pretty quick. Um, our partner doesn't look to be shot or anything like that. We probably should have just got the GTA 6 out straight away. That's actually a good point, actually. How have I got the G36 in the group? I can't remember whether I even checked any of that stuff. Yeah. Okay, we've got, yeah, we've got the kit that we need, the G36. So we'll just pull that back away. And we're going to hand them straight over to firearms officers, which we seem to... I don't know, just not a lot of firearms is back up. Okay. So we're going to get back on call. We've got a disturbance. Okay, Los we've Santos just had a disturbance to the subway. All the tubes. So we're just going to go down straight away. Now there's a guy immediately calling us over. We don't need guns, I don't think. Or we've got a gun anyway on our side. We'll just deal with the situation that comes up. Let's speak to this person. Um, quickly, they're on the move. Let me explain what I've seen. Be minding my business. And these two people walked past. They were arguing real bad. It looked like one of them was about to kick off. Just ready to go. I saw them go into the subway station. Sounds like a place to start. Thank you. Okay, no problem. Um, okay, it looks like one of the main firearms officers, which is a normal firearms officer, has attended. And they are immediately on the situation. We're just British trapped. That's why I put the cap on, just to make us look different than the normal firearms. Everyone seems to be able to sprint faster than me, don't they? Are you coming with, or...? Found them. Right, victim. Um, found me, officer. I've been chased by a madman. Okay, so I'm going to withdraw the Glock, just in case we need it. Right, don't know whether... I think the suspect could just be about to board the train. I'm going to put the Glock away for a second. I've just had the train come in, and obviously they're on the run. They might be about to board that train. Now they've hurt someone, but I don't know how bad. I don't know if they're armed or anything, so we're just gonna 
We're going to take our time. Right, can we see anyone? I think they've run down the tunnel, haven't they? Can we get, like, requests for someone to help us? We've got a code 99 right. in... Right, uh, I'm going on to the tunnel, but I'm going to try and get on the path. No, 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 get up on the path, get up on the path. Nope, we're not going to get on the path. Okay, so we're just going to have to slowly take our time. Now, I know this wouldn't happen in real life, jumping on the tracks, but we're just going to do it anyway. For the purpose of the video. Because this person is just absolutely running down these tunnels, I believe. We just need to run faster, though. We've got all this kit on us, so it's near impossible to get them. I th think... I don't even know where they are. I don't know where they are. It's saying they're right above me, or they're right where I am. Unless they're in this other tunnel. Alright, the train's coming. So we need to get back up here. That's saying there's someone in front of the thing, I think. That's why it's just made that noise. Right, it looks like the suspect's got away. Right, I'm terminating pursuit. Dangerous situation. I'm just going to terminate that pursuit because there's no way we can get to them. Right, let's get back up to our car. And in fact, we're going to speak, we're going to sort the witness out. Yo, man, where you at? I ordered that Make sure they're okay. That's if we can even get speak man. to them. And I don't know where my partner's gone. I think my partner stayed with the witness. Sl slash victim. It looks it. Yeah, me as. Okay. And she's gone as well. Okay, so we're just going to get back up on patrol. We've got a civilian requirement. We've just had a call to a civilian stuck on tracks. Obviously, that's quite a serious incident because there is a car stuck on a track where the subway comes up. You know, the underground subway tunnel, the tube that is obviously comes up ground and then goes back down. And obviously, there's a bit of a road there, and obviously, there's been some sort of car crash or something. Our cars broke down, and obviously. We're in charge of transport. I don't know why I tried to fit through that car then. So let's try and get to the situation as quick as we can because it's quite a drive still. Hopefully they'll pull over. The only thing that doesn't pull over is that cop car. It should be trying to assist me. Okay, let's try and get through traffic as quick as we can and as safe as we can though. Right, stop. Stop moving. I don't know why they keep driving. Okay, it's literally just up here on the right. Let's deal with the situation, stop traffic, see if we can get this place going. Okay, I can immediately see the car. Okay, okay right. Let's stop traffic, and hopefully that will also get information. The vehicle has been spotted. Tracks. I think I need to get the person out of the car and we'll drag them out of the car. It's the only safe way of doing it. And then. Let me see those hands! Can we drive the car? Okay, we've got the vehicle off the tracks. How do we drag someone? Oh, there's a tram coming. Um, 
I don't know how to drag them off the tracks. The game won't let me. It's not giving me any. It's not letting me do anything. Okay, the person's just got up. Let's grab him. Okay, now he's dead again. I don't know what's going on, why we're being dragged. Is he alive or is he dead? Okay, he's dead. Right. So I need... Oh, now it's dragging him. Now that the tram's already arrived. Oh, yeah, so now, now it's not cool. It's stopped. Okay, right, so we're going to tend to him again. They're probably wondering why British transport's doing this, obviously because we're in charge of all transportation, and this is quite a serious incident. Although that car is now just stopped in the way of the tracks. I believe we've got a potential dead person here. I am going to request a ambulance. Ambulance. Just to wait in case. Required in, uh, we could also do Hill. with a helicopter. Uh, hover, land on the ground. We'll clear a bit for it to land on the ground. I don't know that it's going to be able to land there. It might have to land like over here where it's clear. Let's see if it'll do it. Land where that flare is, preferably. I've got a feeling it's just going to make chaos this. It's just going to land randomly, isn't it? Is that even coming down? I don't think it's even coming down, that. Right, well, the ambulance is coming. I believe they're just over there. For some reason, again, they're using the firearms or the traffic on Mark car. Okay, hopefully they can tend to this guy and deal with him. It's not looking good. We're gonna request a check on a carry verda. Fourth of the fifth, two thousand and three. I think it's probably a good thing to maybe have the coroner ready to come. Oh, oh no. Fuck. They've been able to revive him, which is great. So what we're going to do is we're just going to get this vehicle to the side of the road and we'll get it picked up. We'll search it first though, because it's a bit weird, the guy's thing. He'll be breathalyzed, drugs, tested and all that at the hospital. So we'll just do a quick PNC check on the vehicle. We've got a 46 Echo Echo Kilo 572. Target vehicle license plate. Okay, Edward, Edward, it's King, got five, seven, two, expired five, MOT, again, but other than that, it's fine. So let's search the vehicle. What are we going to find? Okay, we found a briefcase full of me methamphetamines and a silencer. Okay. Right, so that's a bit dodgy. What we'll do is we'll request a flatbed to pick it up. We'll get on our scene and we'll get out of the way. We have a civilian requiring assistance. Okay, we have a vehicle on fire in the airport. So we just need to get in there as quick as we can. And get past all these cars. And so, no, he's just gonna he's just decided to just ram straight into us. Idiot. What the hell is he doing? Okay, see the vehicle. You can let us through. Thank you. Oh great. We need, what do I need, what do I need? I need local fire we immediately. Okay, let's got the fire extinguisher, we're gonna go for it. We're gonna try and put it out. Press U. Uh, checks on driving, notice the driver's passed out. Ambulance. Call EMS, Assistance we've already done that remotely. And the how you like to handle the call. Okay, well I'm trying to put it out. It won't let me do anything. Can I get the guy out of the car? No, it won't let me get the guy out of the car. Let's see if we can get him out. I just can't get him out. I need EMS. I need the paramedics to maybe drag him out or something.
Hopefully they can help. Here come a cavalry. We've put out, that, put out the fire, but it's now smoking, but we can't open the car. The car's completely locked. We need the paramedics. There you go, the paramedics and firefighters to get them out. Right. I would Stay like cool. to request a vehicle that. check. Attention. Okay, the vehicle just vanished. Yeah. Excellent. Yeah. No right, so the situation has been dealt with, so that is good, so we're going to get back on point. Edward, Edward we have a okay, we have a little disturbance in the tube tunnels, so it's down that off ramp, but it's, we can't get to it unless we go all the way around. It's a little bit of a pain, but I'm sure we can get there as soon as possible. Got both sirens on, let's make as much noise as we can, let people know what we are coming through. Hopefully we can actually deal with this situation though, it's not like last time where they run through the tunnels and we have to terminate the pursuit, which is too dangerous. I'm sure we can deal with it. I might even take the rifle, just, you know, we're going to be down there. If we're down there we won't have a clue what's going on. So it's too late, but we do have the handgun though, don't we? So I don't know if it's worth even taking the rifle. No, I'll just stick to the Glock. See, that's saying above. Let's go to the situation. Let's go to where it's actually saying to go to. Ah, it's telling me to go up there. Okay, I apologise. I didn't see that. Okay, there's a woman there waiting for us to help. What's going on? Quickly, they're about to move. Um... In my own business, these two people walk past the arguing, which way to go? They enter the subway tunnel. Okay, thank you for I'm letting so us know. Sorry. Okay. Get in, get in, get in, mate, quickly. Two individuals which have caused a disturbance. Alright, so we're gonna go as quick as we can. We're just gonna quickly drive over that pavement but we're gonna park here. Right, let's go. Let's go as fast as we can so this person doesn't jump onto the tracks. It might even be the same person. It's causing a nuisance and they've ran a little cross to this subway using the tunnels. I hope not, because that's really dangerous, but that might be the situation. Whoa, we got shots fired, we got shots fired, we got shots fired. Armed police, everyone, calm down. No, no, don't run that, don't run back. Do not run back in. We've had shots fired, we've had shots fired. I need... All available danger units on alert. Backup required in, uh, Los Santos International. Okay, suspects there, suspects there, moving in for an arrest. Police, put the weapon down. Put the weapon down, now, slowly. That's it, slowly put the weapon down. Put the weapon down. No, she just not put the weapon down. Suspects down, suspects down. In International Airport. I need paramedics immediately. Right, I've made the weapon Airport. safe. We are going to try and tend to this woman. See where we can revive her. I don't know if it's going to let me. Ambulance. Assistance required in Los Santos International. Okay, it won't let me tend to her at all. Oh, hang on, there you go, tend to the injured. There we go. While we wait for an ambulance. It looks like there's another suspect as well. Obviously, there was meant to be two, but I think he's fleeing, but my partner's going to go and chase him. Right, okay, we're going to have that on. I'm going to have response and ARV, purely because we're also going to have empaths up in the sky assisting. Okay, CPR failed. Or did it? No, the yeah, they are dead. Where the hell is my ambulance? Where the hell is this ambulance? It should be here by now. Okay, mate, put the put the gun away. There's no need to. Okay, so we're gonna search the person just to make sure they've got nothing on them, like an explosive or anything like that. That's gonna cause a major situation to the scene. What have we got? Okay, they've just got the handguns. So they have two handguns, the one that was shooting us and the other one. Um, gonna tend to the injured one more time and hopefully the paramedics turn up. 
I'm not too sure where they are. Unless we drag them all the way out of the station. That's the only other way I can think we could do this. I think we could probably do that. Well, firearms have attended and assisted, but... That's no use, unfortunately. We need the paramedics. Oh, there you go. Here are the paramedics, finally. Okay, I think the situation is being dealt with. Let's dismiss this guy. Off he goes. Right, we need to call a coroner then, unfortunately. I don't think this paramedic's in a bit to do anything, is he? What's the situation? Is she alive? Is she dead? No, nope, nothing they can do. Okay, I'm going to request a... Coronet, because that's the only thing I can do in this situation, unfortunately. The other suspect <laughs> fled, I believe, and got away, but we got a vehicle red and so the helicopter was on it. He was shot and killed by a handgun, that's fine, that's what we were dealing with, we were in the situation. Really, we probably should have got the G36s out then, we would have been straight away just on it. I don't know how long the coroner's going to be. Here we go, coroner's here. Okay, so let's get back on patrol. Okay guys, that is where we're going in this episode. It's probably going to be a small one, but I don't want to branch out too much. And obviously I'm trying to make these videos smaller so you can enjoy more. So please guys, I hope you've enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.